Hey friends, this is Latif Oak here. Well and welcome to the new update on Zelika coin. Today is a very important and bit critical day for Zelika because it is slightly moved down below than the support of 8 cents that we were looking at uh, at the support in my previous video. And right now we are at the uh, next support that is approximately at 6.8 cents. And in today's video, we will take a look at whether is there any possibility for the price line to recover back from here. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel then do subscribe it and for more ideas you can also support me here at the patreon because here i'm sharing different trading ideas for you and you can find the link to join me here in the video's description i've shared so let's start the analysis first of all uh, let me to recall this uh, my last trade setup of uh, zelika that i shared for my members at the patreon on 16th of march and that was a harmonic bullish reversal guardly move and by the way this move was uh, with the bitcoin pair and uh, our sell targets as per the Fibonacci sequence was uh, from 105 to 110 B BDC, 0.0000, uh, 110 Bitcoins. And after playing this chart, we can see that the price line even rallied beyond the sell targets. That was a very, very big pump. After this formation of the guard lay, it uh, started a very, very huge pump. And we can see during this, uh, Zelika also broke out a very big resistance of a falling wedge pattern on the candlestick on the weekly time frame chart that was started on 21st of march and during this move zelika also broke out this red line that is the exponential moving average 21 on this weekly time frame chart and uh, we have been watching this uh, since uh, zelika broke down this uh, ema 21 uh, here on 17th of may 2021 uh, it was breaking as a very strong resistance for the price line. You can see we had a rejection here and we broke out for a while EMA 21 here, but we were rejected by the resistance of the falling wedge here and moved down again. And again, same happens. Uh, we for a while broke out this resistance of EMA 21, but rejected by the resistance of the wedge. And here we broke out the EMA 21 and the uh, resistance of this uh, falling wedge pattern together. And right now you can see that we are testing this EMA 21 on the weekly time frame. And there is another critical point here that we are uh, slightly moved down below than this support of EMA 21. But it has already happened previously. If we take a look at the previous history, then we can see that previously when Zelika broke out this resistance of EMA 21 here back on 27th of April 2020, uh, then here while retesting the previous uh, the, the EMA 21 as a support uh, for a while we moved down slightly uh, moved down below this uh, then the support of EMA 21 but when we recovered back uh, we can see that we had a very very big rally if I place this Fibonacci tool then we can see that was more than 1440 percent very very huge rally and then we formed this down channel here and even at that time you can see that stochastic just touched the oversoles on here and same as like that the stochastic has just touched the oversoles on and within next week it will be completely entered the oversoles on as well now if you switch to the daily time frame then this was the support i was showing you at eight cents that was a very strong support you can see previously it had been breaking as a resistance here as a support here and as a resistance here as a support here and as a support here and as a, a resistance here as well and right now we are moved down to the next support that we have at 6.8 cents and you can see previously it had been breaking as a resistance here and as a support here and as a support here and as a support here as well therefore right now it can again work as a support and we have broken down this red line that is the uh, 200 daily simple moving average and we are now at the support of the 100 daily simple moving average that is the red line now if we switch to the very small time frame on the hourly time frame chart then uh here uh, zelika has formed this down channel and now it is likely to have a bounce by the support of the down channel now for example if it will once again touch the resistance here that will be approximately at 7.9 cents or 8 cents so there will be a possibility that at the same time it will try to break out this resistance of the down channel 
and also the resistance of this eight cents that was a few hours back breaking as a uh, support now it can break as a resistance and once again if it will be able to break out this eight cents resistance then it can turn into the support once again for zelica so next few, uh, next few hours are very important for zelica we are getting bounced by the support of the channel by the way the target for this down channel in case of breakout can be here approximately at 13.4 cents and one more very important thing that i want to tell you here that this is the four hourly time frame chart not the hourly time frame chart so this was the update so far i hope that you've liked the analysis then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well and for more ideas you can also support me here at the patreon because here i'm sharing different trading ideas for you and you can find the link to join me here in the video's description i've shared take care goodbye